When he was reassured that the kids would stay locked in their rooms and that the principal would abide by the strict punishment he enforced, Drop D rushed off to his mansion. His sole desire was to lay on his soft, comfortable bed and forget all this nuisance caused by the little devils. So he closed his eyes and surrendered to sleep. As he drifted off, a weird dream started to form in his mind. He found himself in an empty room standing in front of a mirror. Yet he looked different. All of a sudden, he felt that the image he was looking at, this ugly, miserable and cold face, was his own soul staring back at him. He reached out his hand to touch his reflection, but instead of being able to touch the hard glass surface, Drop D started sinking and getting pulled inside the mirror. He screamed for help, but strangely, no sound came out. Then, all of a sudden, a shadow approached him. When Mr. Funka grabbed his arm, Drop D wondered whether he was there to help him or punish him for the ugliness of his soul. Inside his mind, the weird voice of Funka started echoing.